all the way up to the highest notch. Whoops. Yeah, we're it's it's already on. <laughs> Reverse is very touchy. <laughs> Reverse is very touchy, as you guys just heard. So yeah. Fucking send it in reverse might be a little dangerous. <laughs> just just uh, be careful. So here we go. We got it turned all the way up. You can see. Fucking send it. And we are fully green all the way. What do you think about the modes? Which one are you liking the most? Fucking send it. Fucking send it? Fucking sent the donut? What? What's up Mopar fam? I hope everybody's having a blessed day out there. I hope everybody had a fantastic Christmas and a great new year. Today we're going to do a new video. We have a new product that we're going to test out and this is a pedal controller from fucking tuned. Literally that's the name. Pretty cool. We're going to be putting it on my brother-in-law's 22 Ram 1500 with the 5.7 Hemi of course. This truck is 100% bone stock except for carnage performance muffler that's installed other than that 100 percent bone stock not even a cold air intake nothing stock 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 so we're going to get a little before video of the throttle response and how the truck reacts and then we're going to install the new fucking tune device which is going to enhance the throttle response take the lag out of the acceleration um, these things are very adjustable. You can make these things basically feel like a one-to-one -one, uh, throttle, kind of like back in the old school days where you'd have a throttle cable. Um, so when you had a throttle cable, if you move the gas pedal, the engine would actually react. It would, it would rev up pretty much instantaneous. Today's vehicles pretty much all are throttled by wire now. Um, so it's electronically controlled. So when you mash the gas pedal, they usually have a horrible throttle delay. Um, this truck is one of those victims. All of the Mopars pretty much have that very terrible throttle response and very, very laggy. Um, so this device is going to fix that and we're going to go check it out. We're going to install this thing real quick and see if it'll wake up the Hemi in this Ram. So let's get to it. All right, Mopar fam, we are in the 22 Ram 1500. This is Tony. Uh, this is my brother-in-law. You guys have seen this truck on the channel before when we did the Carnage Performance Muffler. Um, this truck is bone stock and it's a good test vehicle to check out this new fucking tuned pedal device that we're going to install. Um, so we're going to go down here and just do a couple of like stop and goes to kind of give you a before and after experience and for ourselves exactly how this new fucking tuned pedal device works and see if it'll wake up this Hemi and take that throttle lag out that all of these trucks and cars today have with the new throttle by wire designs. So we're going to go down here, give it a couple of throttle whacks and see how it goes. So this is a dead stop and we're going to just kind of hammer the gas pedal and see how it reacts before we install the fucking tuned device. So here we go. that is it's like a really smooth kind of acceleration it's not like really hard off of the line um, it, it's it's like it, it just gradually gets really fast um, and honestly I don't it didn't even spin the tires when we took off so maybe we can get it to spin the tires with the new fucking tune device that would be awesome because it's gonna make the throttle very more instant so That'd be cool. We'll see if that actually happens. All right, Mopar fam. So this is the box that the new fucking tune 
throttle enhancer device comes in. Um, it's like a little small plastic case. Pretty cool. And you can see the logo on there. Fucking tune performance throttle response. So we're going to open this thing up real quick. Kind of go over what's in there and get this thing installed. So inside you have a little card and this is basically telling you about the registration um, for activation and the app. There's a little QR code on the back to scan with your phone. Um, this should work with everything, Androids, Apple, whatever you got. And the website on there as well. Um, the user manual QR code. So you're going to need to download the app to be able to run and control uh, the throttle device and you know set your pro uh, to be able to set it to what settings you want um, how aggressive you want this thing so on so on we'll go through the app here in a minute when we get it installed um, so basically the unit itself tucked away in this nice little case and these things are pretty simple to install I mean it's a plug-and-play operation um, they got two connectors on the little harness that comes out of the device. So one's going to plug into the throttle pedal. Um, one's going to plug into the factory uh, vehicle connection that used to plug onto the throttle. And I like this American flag on the device itself. That's pretty cool. And the other thing down here, it looks like they supply you with a couple of zip ties. So you can tie up the extra cable slack if need be. So we're going to go inside the truck real quick and try to get this thing installed. All right, so down here in the floorboard, obviously you have your gas pedal right here up on top. Hopefully the camera will pick this thing up. You have your wire connector up top. Um, basically, you're going to unplug that. You, you're going to plug in the fucking tuned throttle device. Uh, wiring harness into that and then you're going to plug in the other connector into the factory vehicle harness that you used to plug on to the throttle pedal it's that simple uh takes a few minutes that's it so we're going to get that done real quick all right so we have the fucking tuned app downloaded on our cell phone so we're going to kind of go through here um it looks like did it scan and it found the device right there so you're gonna hit that scan button um, and then it should find the pedal device through Bluetooth. Cool. <laughs> All right, so this is pretty cool. I really like this app, guys. So um, when you go to scan, it should pop up. Um, it found a device. You're going to select that device, then it's going to ask you to enter that device's serial number, um, which is probably on the controller itself, but it's also right here on the box. Um, you can see right here, that's the serial number. So you're going to type in those serial numbers. Um, once it links to it and connects here, well, <laughs> this is pretty cool. There's your options. You got fucking slow, fucking cruise, fucking fast which we're definitely uh, interested in that. And finally at the bottom, fucking we got fucking send it. So <laughs> I guess we're gonna start with, uh, well, I'd say fuck the slow. Let's just start with the cruise because I have a feeling that'll probably be more like a, a one to one pedal ratio where it, you know, it should take a lot of the lag out of it. Um, so we're gonna test it there first and then work our way up and see how it goes. But that's pretty much the the the, uh, the standard settings right there. Now I do believe if you go into it a little further, like let's click on the cruise one. Now when you click on one of the options, you see you have a minus and plus arrow. Well, you can turn it. You can turn that mode down or up. Um, it looks like about four more settings. Um, so if it's a little too aggressive, you can turn it down. Um, if you want to make that option a little more aggressive, you can turn it up. So we're going to start them off on the middle setting. Just leave it dead, dead set where they have it already programmed and see how the truck reacts. 
Um, so here we go. We are on fucking cruise, and we are gonna literally go fucking cruise. <laughs> All right, so we have the fucking tune device installed. We are on fucking cruise mode. Um, we did not adjust that mode at all. It is right in the middle where the factory has it programmed. So we're gonna go cruise a little bit and see how it does. This is kind of going to be the more stock. It seemed a little bit faster to respond to me on that one. It's hard to tell being a passenger. I don't know. Does it seem about the same? It's about the same right there. Really about the same? We'll turn it up to four. So, so we're going to max out. We're going to max out the fucking cruise mode and I bump it up to uh, the highest setting on that mode. So we're raising it up about four notches and then seeing if it, that seems a little more touchy now, doesn't it? I can feel it. Oh yeah. driving and see like if you feel it feels more instantaneous I think. let's try out fucking fast I do like the fact you can do all this on the go you don't have to stop and do anything all right let's see all right so we're on fucking fast and we're gonna leave that mode we're gonna leave that fucking fast mode in the middle. We're not gonna turn it up or down. We're gonna try it out right there and see what that does. Our tires, I heard the tires squeak on that time. <laughs> that was just a little bump. Let's do a dead, dead stop thing too on that one. Let's see what fucking fast in the middle it feels so, like from a dead stop. Traction so controls off. Damn! Damn! good thing because yeah. I think a Hemi even if it's stock should be able to spin the tires bump it to four. all right so we're gonna move the fucking fast mode we're gonna bump it up to the, the most aggressive mode um, so we're raising fucking fast to basically level four if that's what you want to call it and uh, see how much more aggressive fucking fast mode feels we're gonna test it out here again when we get a little bit more level. Pretty good. Feels a lot better. Yeah. Definitely feels like it's kicking the right one on the tail. Yeah, it's it's really they're really these throttle these throttle things are more noticeable when you're just regularly driving it. Cause you'll notice you don't have to push the pedal as as far as you used to to get it to start to go. <laughs> yeah, like Definitely more respond. on fucking fast, all the way bumped up to the the fourth level. There's zero lag in it. I can tell you that. That's for sure. Zero lag, and we have the tires actually chirping finally on this stock Ram 1500. So the last thing we to do is go to fucking. 
fucking send it. So we're gonna click fucking send it. And so we got it in fucking send it mode. We're gonna leave it in the middle and try it real quick before we turn it up to the highest setting. Oh shit! <laughs> try and see what it does on the fucking send it mode again all right here we go oh yeah So we're going literally full fucking send. So we got fucking send it mode. Turn all the way up to the highest notch. Whoops. Yeah, we're, it's, it's already on. <laughs> Reverse is very touchy. <laughs> Reverse is very touchy, as you guys just heard. Um, so yeah. Fucking send it in reverse might be a little dangerous. <laughs> just just uh, be careful. So here we go. We got it turned all the way up. You can see. Fucking send it. And we are fully green all the way. Alright, so now we're at a level spot. And try it one more time. Oh yeah. So, so far... What do you think about the modes? Which one are you liking the most? Fucking send it. Fucking send it? <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Fucking sent the donut? What? <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, um, I think that concludes today's video that we got the stock Hemi to finally burn the uh, to finally burn rubber and actually do small burnouts and a donut we just did a damn donut i don't know does it has this truck done a donut yet yeah, that's the first one so far <laughs> that's the first one so far yeah. so fucking tuned fucking send it all the way to the max get your hemi to spin the tires and go do a donut so hope you guys enjoyed the video uh stay tuned we'll have more videos on this thing in the future link will be in the video description below uh, take you right to it and get you hooked up with your fucking tuned unit so again guys i appreciate everybody following the channel make sure hit that subscribe button give the video a thumbs up comment below what you think of the new fucking tuned throttle controller we're gonna get the fuck out of here before the cops come so let's fucking send it <laughs>